In this video tutorial, I'm going to explain the various functions available to you on the Incident Activity Portal, how to move the mapping layer around, and how to zoom in and zoom out of the map itself. Upon opening the mapping portal, this is the default page that you will see. On the upper part of the map, to the left, we have the search dialog box. This is where you will enter a place name or a postcode to find your local area. In the middle, we have the incident criteria. This will show you how many incidents have occurred in your chosen area of interest and the type of incident that Derbyshire Fire and Rescue Service have dealt with. And to the right is the date timeline that we are using to show our incident data. We are depicting our data in three monthly periods, with the most recent data being at the top of the list. We will be providing our incident data in these quarterly periods, building to three years worth of information. Therefore, eventually, there will be 12 periods of activity data for you to view and compare. On the left of the map are a series of drawing and editing tools in addition to the zoom out function and the zoom in function to the map itself. As you move over the buttons, a little dialog box appears, informing you of what function it will perform. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'm using a computer, keyboard and mouse. However, as the portal is a web-based application, the functionality will be the same if you have a touch screen device, such as a tablet or a smartphone. So let's begin with moving around and zooming in and out of the map. To zoom in to the map, left mouse click on the plus symbol and the map will zoom in. And again, left mouse click and we've zoomed into the map. To zoom out of the map, we left mouse click on the minus symbol and again and the map will zoom out. To move the map around, if you left mouse click, but hold the button down and actually move the mouse, and in effect what you're doing is grabbing the map and moving it around. And when you've finished, just let go of the left mouse button. So again, left mouse, click on the map, hold the button down, move the mouse, and grab the map to move it around. And when you've finished, just let go of the left mouse button. On the bottom of the screen here, you will find a link back to our website. Uh, 
There is also a link to our Facebook page. And a link to our Twitter account. In addition, there is an email contact for you to provide any comments or for you to ask questions about the site. This then concludes the initial overview of our incident activity mapping program.